In this life, we can't always do great things, but we can always do something small with great love. The most commonly reported reason why Americans do not volunteer is a lack of free time. However, I think that there is a common misconception that you need an abundance of free time in order to make a real difference in your community. I, for example, set aside a few hours every Saturday morning with my Service Saturday project to give back to various organizations across San Diego. Most of those service projects are environmental in nature because San Diego is not only one of the most diverse ecosystems in our country, but it is also one of the most endangered. We are home to over 200 imperiled plant and animal life, one of which is the California Least Tern, which I've spent the past two years volunteering to help restore their nesting sites in San Diego. Not only is volunteering for environmental projects important to San Diego, but it's something that's important to me as well. I myself have always felt very connected to nature, having grown up in front of a wildlife preserve and often helping my mother rehabilitate sick and injured animals. I also spent two years volunteering for the National Oceanic and Atmospheric Administration's Cooperative Shark Tagging Program. In every one of my Service Saturday projects, I learn a little bit more about my community and what its needs are. The amazing part about volunteering is that there is something out there for every single person, depending on what their interests and their special talents and abilities are. This is how I first got involved with volunteering. My college roommate, who loved to volunteer, would always try to get me to come along with her. And it wasn't until that she invited me along to an environmental project that I went with her. In order to encourage others in my community to volunteer, I, like my college roommate, have invited people along to events that I think that would be something of interest to them. I have a friend who loves marine biology, so I invited her along to some beach cleanups. My trainer, I invited along to various 5Ks, and I invited one of my friends who loves fashion to Operation That's My Dress. There is always an organization out there that is in need of your unique skill set and interests. I strongly believe it is every single person in our community's responsibility to give back. My goal as Miss World America is to encourage everyone within my community to take ownership of their community, to give back in a way that speaks to them. These small actions done with love can and will change our world. Gone are the days of the grass is greener on the other side, and here to stay is the sentiment, the grass is greener where you water it. I invite you to pick up that watering can and see just how much beauty can grow in this world when we all care just a little bit more.